Hey there, this is TTH, and today I'm playing Kerbal Space Program! So, um, first of all, uh, if you don't know the game, well, this video is not really for you, uh, as I will assume that uh, the viewers of that video know at least a little bit about the game, so I won't explain the basics or anything, as I'm doing this video for the KSP forums! So, um, so yeah, uh, so this thing is more about uh, an idea I had, so that would be a, a quote-unquote proof of concept um, of uh, the idea I had. So, um, the problem when you have uh, a ship stranded on another planet is that uh, sometimes uh, it has three crew members. So, to bring back all three crew members, you need to send another ship. But the problem is, you cannot bring all three back, as there's no such thing as uh, a four crew member pod or something. So, you have to do uh, two travels to bring everybody back. So, the idea here would be to uh, quite literally uh, push the entire ship. Bring it back, uh, yes. So, um, so the concept here is that uh, that big box here is in fact a receptacle for uh, another ship. So, which would be this thing here, and uh, it's being it's being held with those um, landing struts. So, I'll try to get that thing out. Uh, and uh, let's pull back. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. So yeah. The idea is that uh, if you get that thing uh, inside the recept the receptacle that is designed specifically for the ship, you can uh, rotate that ship and uh, push it and bring it somewhere else. Uh, without having to use uh, the pushed ship's fuel. Yes, fuel is a very complicated word. I'm sorry if I offended you guys by my by my lack of English vocabulary. Yeah, uh, whatever. So um, so yeah. Um, so this thing is more prototype than anything, and uh, um, this is. Uh, just a proof of concept, as I said earlier, and uh, uh, yeah, so I'll try to demonstrate you guys the thing. So the idea would be to rendezvous with uh, the ship here, and then get it into the, the receptacle, and then close the thing so it doesn't go away, like that. So uh, the design would be different for uh, the the type of ship you would use. You could even uh, make something smaller with only the um, the control pod, uh, if that's how it's called. Um, command pod, yes. And, uh, and yeah, so first of all, let's see. As you can see, there are two uh, different entities in this thing. Uh, there's the ship and there's the, the, the dummy ship, uh, which needs to be pushed. So, uh, you can see here, um, yeah, I'm pointing on my screen, but you can't see that. Um, so, uh, there's the Space Pusher debris and the Space Pusher tester. Uh, well, so uh, actually, I used uh, uh, both ships, uh, both parts were uh, part of the same ship because I'm, this is just uh, a test. So yeah, and also since I'm terrible at designing ships, I had to use uh, the cheats to get in to get it into orbit. Uh, so that thing is, as I said, it's it's only a, a proof of concept. So so yeah, and uh, yeah. So now we'll try to get uh, that thing into an escape trajectory. And uh, yeah, so first of all, let's aim towards uh, the vector thing. Oh, and also um, the problem. Uh, there's one. There's one flow in that thing, uh, which would be uh, 
time the time acceleration thing so if you time accelerate uh, when there's another ship uh, here uh, you will pass through it you will pass through it and since uh, since they don't have the exact same speed uh, well that could be a problem but yeah Great demonstration! No, really. But we still can do it. Uh, the landing legs were here just to hold the thing in case we would need to decelerate or something, but it will still work as we are just trying to get into an escape uh, velocity trajectory or something. Yeah. You ruined my demonstration, you damned stupid rocket! Oh, whatever. Um, so yeah, and let's accelerate a bit more, and, and that should be good. Um, I would rather not use the physical time acceleration uh, for, the, for the fact that uh, it tends to mess a bit with ships, as uh, it doesn't work too well yet, and uh, yeah, but... Uh, but for a moment, uh, let's see, we are getting speed. And you would notice something. The, 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 the debris thing. Uh, look at the blue orbit first. And when I'm, when I'm hovering uh, our ship, you would see another white orbit around it. And that would be the debris uh, or dummy rocket. Um, Orbit, yes. Uh, yeah, maybe I should have used another save as there's a bit of junk around uh, around Kerbin, but yeah. Um, so yeah, that was my idea uh, because the thing is, uh, well, you could also use this design to bring a rocket uh, towards to another planet or something. Um, as docking is still not in, but will come on the next update. But until then, uh, I think that ID could be a way to have uh, to to make a ship not use uh, the fuel, uh, its fuel or something. And I know there's a, I know with the the, the, the time acceleration thing, uh, it doesn't, it's not really reliable. But uh, the point here is just to get the thing into an escape trajectory so you can save a bit of fuel and uh, yeah and uh, now let's see let's see the orbit not oh, the orbit the orbit yes you can see it's moving slowly but surely and uh, well i'll skip it for you guys and i'll see you guys when it's about to reach the escape trajectory the Escape velocity. Yes. Yes. Okay, see you guys in a moment. Um quick update. Uh we still haven't reached the the desired velocity, but um it's not very reliable right now. Um the one of the uh of the pain thing uh, was destroyed by by the, the pushed ship so right now it's still not really a problem uh, but it could become uh, later if if it moves a bit too much so so yeah uh oh more damage ah oh well should still be able to do it so we will see Okay, things should be going a bit faster now, so we didn't lose uh, any other part of our receptacle and receptacle, yes, and we are about to reach escape velocity, so there we go. Okay, so now we can see, so I don't expect to uh, reach any other body or something, pretty sure that, does, that won't work. As my, as I am a bit uh, off the the plane, so whatever. But yeah, so 
technically uh, we could uh, get rid of our pusher and just let our um, everything be and yeah it's still here I was a bit worried it wasn't displayed but yeah and yeah so what we are going to do now is just get rid of it and let it be let it go you're free my friend leave go away now a little bit of pop, pop, pop. come on don't want to be free you want your freedom take it that's what I'm cutting on come on and there we go uh, so as you can see this is not really a ship this is a debris uh, and he doesn't want to go <laughs> Ugh. Come on, guy. No, 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 no. Oh. Well, he'll have to go eventually. Get away. Give you a push and goodbye. Hmm. And there we go. So, yeah. Now, let's switch that thing and uh, yeah. And yeah, so now we can just time accelerate a bit. Uh -huh. Away from the other thing, from the pusher, and we are now into an escape trajectory around the sun. And no, I'm not calling it Kerbal, because it's not called Kerbal. At least not in the game. So yeah, we are having our thing again. I could say thing, but you could replace it pretty much with um, anything, I guess. Uh, come on, faster, please. Okay, and re and there we go. I guess there was where did where did it go? It's uh, it's the love that it's still here. Okay, so yeah, that was the idea. Um, and now, well, I don't really know. Oh wait, do we have an encounter? Oh yes, we do. Interesting. Interesting. I would say, yeah, it's gonna take forever, but yeah, <laughs> we've got an encounter, which is completely accidental, but yeah. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in a moment. Okay, about to reach Kerbin an Encounter, and enc yes, Encounter, Encounter, or encoun Encounter, Encounter, yeah. I fail at it in English. I fail at English. I know. Stop saying that. You're already thinking it out loud. It's hurting my feelings. Okay, not really, but yeah. So, so yeah. I I pretty much demonstrated the the thing. I guess. Uh, I guess uh, someone could probably do a better job than me uh, if that in if, if that ID uh, is of any interest to him or and uh, yeah so wait is the space pusher going to crash into Kerbin well first let's see pop 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 and uh, yeah <laughs> well that was interesting yeah uh, well, yeah, if anyone uh, has a, an idea on how to improve this design, uh, go ahead, uh, I'm not gonna, uh, well, I don't know. Yeah, 
really uh, <laughs> I don't know really uh, I'm, uh, I'm still a bit new to commentary and stuff so so yeah we going to encounter mm, barely yeah whatever so thanks for watching and uh, uh, if you guys uh, know how to improve this design uh, go ahead and make it yours it's just an idea I had so so yeah space pusher okay see you next time guys no explosion I am disappointed